Keeping it cool, why indoor climate matters for cognitive health. When we think about the effects of climate change, we often focus on the environment, weather, or physical health. But what if I told you that something as simple as the temperature in your home could directly impact your brain? That's exactly what a groundbreaking study from the Marcus Institute for Aging Research has revealed. This research focused on older adults and found a striking relationship between indoor temperatures and cognitive performance. The sweet spot for maintaining attention appears to be between 68 and 75 degrees Fahrenheit, or 20 to 24 degrees Celsius. Once temperatures drift outside this range, either hotter or colder, the likelihood of experiencing attention difficulties doubles with just a 7-degree shift. The study tracked 47 adults aged 65 and older over an entire year, monitoring their home temperatures alongside self-reported attention difficulties. The findings suggest that even in current climate conditions, many older adults are living in environments that could impair their cognitive abilities. What makes this even more concerning is how climate change could amplify the problem. As global temperatures rise and weather becomes more extreme, maintaining this cognitive-friendly indoor temperature range could become increasingly difficult, particularly for low-income and underserved populations. For those without access to adequate cooling or heating, the risk to cognitive health is significantly higher. This research adds to a growing body of evidence that climate change doesn't just affect physical health, it reaches into our brains. And for older adults, who are already at increased risk of cognitive decline, this could have profound implications. What can we do? The study's authors suggest actionable solutions, such as implementing smart home technologies to optimize indoor climates, improving energy efficiency in housing, and expanding access to cooling resources. These interventions won't just make homes more comfortable, they could actively protect the cognitive health of aging populations. As Dr. Amir Baniasadi, the study's lead author, points out, this isn't just a scientific discovery, it's a call to action. If we're serious about safeguarding cognitive health in a warming world, we need public health strategies and housing policies that prioritize climate resilience for older adults. This research highlights an often overlooked intersection of climate change, public health, and cognitive science. An intersection that could define how we care for aging populations in the years to come. This video is based on the research paper, Home Ambient Temperature and Self-Reported Attention in Community-Dwelling Older Adults, by Amir Baniasadi et al. in Journals of Gerontology Series A. What do you think about this research? Drop us a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more neuroscience news updates.